It is time for question and answer with the head, as promised. Um, today I have questions from our maternal and lower school students that I'd like to share with you. Okay, so I'm just going to take these as in the order they came in. Um, Megan and Chelsea would like to know, how many patients have you had, Dr. Bin? Hmm, that is an excellent question, Megan and Chelsea. Um, I am a different kind of doctor. I'm not a medical doctor. Uh, my master's degree is in comparative literature. My other master's degree is in English, uh, in teaching English as a second language. And my doctoral degree is in organizational leadership. So I don't see patients, I see students. Um, this means if you have a cold, I am not especially helpful to you. But if you ever have a literary emergency and you need help with Kafka or Camus or organizational theory, I'm your girl. So call me. Uh, our next question is from Milan. Um, Milan wants to know, Est-ce que tu fais du sport? Oui, Milan, je fais du sport. Uh, je ne suis pas très forte là-dedans. Je fais du yoga le matin et j'avoue que je suis un désastre en yoga. Vraiment un désastre. Mais ça me fait du bien quand même. Et je fais aussi dans ce temps, euh, dans ce temps de, de confinement, je fais aussi des balades avec ma famille et, de, et avec notre chien. Eden wants to know whether I have a pet. I do indeed have a pet. Uh, my family has a scruffy little dog named Satchel. We adopted him from the SPCA four years ago. Uh, he is small and smelly and not very smart and wonderful. We adore him and he is keeping us good company now that we are sheltering in place. I think you will meet Satchel in another video, another time. Sophia has a question about me. Um, did you ever have long hair at any point? Yes, Sophia, I did. Uh, when I was little, well, when I was young, I was never very little. But when I was young, when I was a little girl, I had long hair. Um, I had two very long brown braids for a very long time. Uh, I had it cut actually in France once, very short, and I never looked back. But as you can see, uh, during shelter in place, my hair is growing. So you may see it long yet. That could happen. And maybe a final question for this morning comes from Zoe. Zoe wants to know, are you afraid of anything? Yeah, all of us are afraid of things, Zoe. Uh, I, for example, do not like mice. Um, it's kind of funny that someone so tall would be afraid of something so small, but I am. But I'm not a fearful person. Um, I believe in our community. I believe in the people around me. And I know that we can meet any challenge we're facing. Just look at us right now. We're doing fine. So thank you for asking, and I hope you're not afraid either. That's it for today, French American and International. I look forward to talking to you again soon. Take good care. Bye-bye.